Welcome back to our next episode for our LMS Big Dude tutorial. So this time around, I'm going to teach you this this tutorial is specially designed for our students on how to register for our LMS website. So this will serve us as, as our students guide. So there are two ways on how to register to our website. First, you need to have a browser or any browser like Google Chrome or Microsoft Edge. But at this point of time, I will let my students use the Moodle application, which is very convenient because they can make use of their Android phones okay, using the Moodle app application. Okay. So, let me show you my cell phone. Okay. So, first, you have to proceed to the um, Play Store. You have to find the Play Store app. Okay. And then in your Play Store, you have to type model. Model. Okay. So here you are. You are going to click this one. Letter M. Model. Then click install. You have to wait for a while because um, the installation this this one or downloading this app will take a little bit of your time. That's fifty six percent. Okay. Eighty two percent. Okay, and then ninety six percent. Then it's already installing. Okay, so the installation has been completed, so we'll go back and then we're going to click open. Okay, since I'm going to teach the students okay, for this video tutorial, so we have to click I'm a learner. If you're a student, you have to click I'm a learner. And if you are a teacher, if you are a teacher, you can click I'm a I'm an educator, so I'm going. I'm going to click. I'm a learner. Okay, take note. Uh, the here, there is a your site. So we are going to input our official URL address. That is https. A okay. then colon. A okay. one more. Then DAPA NHS.com. If you can take notice, there is an S after P, it means that our website is a secured site. So, afterwards, you are going to, con to click on connect to your site. Okay, so our website has been found. So, DAPA National High School. Okay, so there is a username and pass or password. Okay, we are going to leave this behind. We are going to choose the Google Students at the bottom part. We are going to click this one, the Google Students. Okay. Okay, and then and then I have to choose, for example, here. For my student's account, I'm going to use the shareground on account gmail.com. Okay, then you have to click allow. Okay, and there you have it. You have successfully registered to our website. So sir, what am I am I going to do next afterwards? Okay, the next thing that you have you are going to do is to locate or to find your course or your subject. 
Okay, you have to scroll down first. Okay, you have to scroll down how to find the course categories. So here is the course categories. Course categories. Okay, this one. We're going to click this one, course categories. Okay, if you are a senior high school, you're going to click a sen the senior high school button. If you are a junior high school, you're going to click junior high school. So, I prefer the senior high school button. Click on that one. And then, you're going to choose what grade level are you. For example, I'm going to choose the grade 12. Okay. And then, you have to find uh, the... You have to locate the the subject or the course that you need to enroll okay, for example here normally my students are come are the, the students that are with me are taking introduction to the philosophy of your human person so i have to click on this one introduction okay so when i click this one since i am already enrolled this one i can have i can have already the the activities, all the the lessons here, I can I can browse on them, and then before answering all the activities, see to it that you have read and understand all the lesson. Okay, so prior to that, uh, sometimes the the course upon enrollment will ask you for an enrollment key for example if you are being prompted to input an enrollment key just ask your teacher to provide you an enrollment key normally your teacher will tell you about the enrollment key so that you can ha have a direct access to the course okay for the time being thank you so much for watching and have a good day thank you so much